What up guys, Matt here, Acoustic Selection. Hope everybody has a happy, happy Thanksgiving. Thank you so much for all the support you've shown me over the past, I guess we've been doing these lessons nine or 10 years now. So it's, uh, I just wanna say thanks so much. I was, I was talking about on my country channel about, um, you know, one of my favorite stories in the Bible is the story about the 10 leopards, where Jesus healed 10 leopards, said that, but one of them came back and gave thanks to the Lord. I always wanna be the one that comes back and says, thank you God, thank you for all the blessings around my life that you've given me, my family, and. Uh, I don't know many of you all feel the same way. And I was thinking about when, with Thanksgiving, one of my favorite kind of Thanksgiving songs is a song called Sanctuary. I thought I would teach that. It has three chords. It's going to be a G, a D, and a C. You can type in Matt McQueen's first four chords. Because uh, I love what it says, with Thanksgiving, I'll be a living uh, sanctuary for you. And I think we're at lives, when we lay down our lives each day like Christ did for us, um, it, can, it can talk about can show us um, kind of just how we're supposed to live as a Christian and I get a little distracted there somebody about came in our room here but uh so start, we'll start with the G Lord prepare me to be a sanctuary D pure and see holy tried and true G to D with thanksgiving I'll be first worship song if you're just starting out a lot of people will write me and say Matt what's a great song to start out with uh, this is a great one so get locked in those two bottom strings of the third fret your G's gonna be the fifth and sixth let's drum all six Lord prepare me and I tell people all the time if you're just learning a song start with just down strums I'm using even no pick to kind of kind of feel the guitar and kind of get that rhythm Lord prepare me to be a sanctuary then keep those bottom two locked and press the third string, second fret. Let's show the bottom four. Sanctuary, pure and Now your C is actually a C at nine, just like your G, but slid down to the fourth and fifth. And you're strumming the bottom five. So again, Lord, prepare me to be a sanctuary, pure and It's a C. Holy, tried and it's a G. True. And that D, they repeat it. With thanksgiving, I'll be a living sanctuary. See here. Weary. In one D. For you. For you. So it's kind of that, all those songs kind of wrap around the end. For you. So again, here's a close up. Lock in the two bottom strings. That's your G, all six. For your C, slide both of those down. So fourth and fifth, let's try the bottom five. And then the D is the bottom four. So all six, bottom five, bottom four. This is a great song if you're starting out. And I always tell people, don't worry about changing so fast or keeping a certain rhythm. Just go slow, do down strums, and really work on that timing. Lord, prepare me to be a sanctuary, pure and holy, tried and true, with thanksgiving, I'll be a living sanctuary. Let me challenge you, let me challenge myself. Let's go out and be a living uh, sanctuary for God. That, that with everything we do, you know, that's what the Christian life is all about, guys. You know, Thanksgiving, we celebrate pilgrims and Mayflowers and all that, but the Christian, our Thanksgiving is what we live every day for. It's not just Christmas, it's not just Easter. We live every day as a, as a sense of Thanksgiving because of the great price that Christ paid for us on the cross. So if you want to mature your faith, you don't try to staple virtues like patience and long-suffering and love and forgiveness. No, 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 you, dig, you get your roots deeper in the gospel. So you, you don't focus on these virtues you try to do. You focus on the great gift Christ gave us on the cross. And when Thanksgiving, our roots get deeper. And when those roots get deeper, they produce the fruits. Some of you have, some of you have us fall a victim of that, and I do this too. 
that we want to sort of practice more patience. We want to practice more love. We want to practice more forgiveness. That's not how it works. You got to dive deeper in the gospel, deeper in the gift that Christ gave us by his, by his death on the cross in our place. And the more our roots get deeper and deeper and deeper, we'll produce the fruits of the Spirit. Love, joy, peace, and long-suffering, so many things, gentleness. So let that be a challenge for you. Happy Thanksgiving. Thank you so much, guys. I love you. Most importantly, God loves you. Have a great day.